This is Backtrack 5. KDE, this will also work for for genome because it doesn't matter which environment you're using because you'll get uh, if you're using uh, the ZD1211RW driver for your wireless uh, you'll get this no such file directory that's um, concerning the um, the firmware and um, the only way to fix that would be to go and get the firmware so we have to go and get it through this website right here this website and I'll provide the website in the bottom video description I can go ahead and get the um, compressed file but I don't really like messy situations so whenever I can avoid them I will uh, we'll go to Firefox and then in Firefox I'll type in the web address so once we got the web address typed in there we're gonna hit enter on our keyboard and then we're going to scroll down any any one of these links works I use the first one because it doesn't matter for me we can click save because we want to save the file because that's what we want to use um, I, I, read, I already made a, um, a folder on my desktop called root and insert and in and then the root I made another folder called uh, downloads so it should appear in there and that's where I'm actually saving it to you can actually click on the browse other folders and then it should take you to another thing and then you should be able to save it there so I'm just, you know I'm not going to show that much because you're you guys are smart once it's done saving because it's not that big it's clear you get another little thing at the bottom on the right side saying something's finished and then we're gonna go into the folder that folder that I just mentioned right there by the LS and the CD would be change would be uh, CD would be uh, change directory and then the LS would be listing the directories so this use the LS and then the CD into desktop and then the LS again and then the CD CD into root capital letters because that's what I type for root capital letters see that's the root right there and then that's the root right there so we're gonna hit enter ls and remember where I placed it at I placed it in downloads and we're gonna list and as you can see there it is right there if you were paying attention we're gonna copy it to uh, it's kind of big to type it all out, so we're gonna bring up the command for installing uh, packages, Debian packages. So dbkgi for install. That's tech i for install. And we're gonna paste the, the top right there because it's kind of big too for me to make the video any longer. Well, anyways, you get the idea because you're smart, right? We're gonna hit enter, and it should start installing. Once it installs. You can use the, the you can use the command to bring up the interface. Uh, and put it into monitor mode and interface mon zero. So air mon ng uh, mon zero uh, start. Uh, oh yeah, uh, iw config to see which one I'm using, and that my interface is WLAN 0 sorry I forgot that airmon ng WLAN uh, start WLAN and it should give me zero errors see right next to that that's that's where that um, thing should be at or the no such file or directory and the something flags or something like that I can't pronounce that quite well myself maybe you can and you laugh at me later on but anyways uh, no such file directory it's no longer there missing so if you're using that driver this is the fix you can go download the the compressed file uh, if you if you need a video on how to put the compressed files into the into the file uh, uh, you know install them then I'll make a video for that but as of now I think I should just tell you to stick with Debian files it's easier commands and stuff like that anyway 
Um, as I'm gonna show you right now. See, it's Hermon ng mon zero because that's the interface we're gonna use. Ah, no, it's arrow dump ng mon zero. I'm getting sleepy now. And there we go. See? See all the all the all the all the captures right there because I'm not thinking right now because I'm sleepy well this is cure my mind saying I'm going back to bed